Hi, some of you may or may not remember me installing this bell box. Link in the description. However, I've undone the screw. Let's take the um, cover off. You see here, there's a grey piece of tape. There's a reason for that. You may be able to just make out why, but let's take it off. You can now clearly see there are two green LEDs flashing alternately. That's what this video is about. They are actually known as comfort lights. They do not actually do anything apart from flash and as the name suggests they give comfort. When I say they give comfort what that actually means is the people that have just had an alarm installed or thinking of having an alarm or know nothing about alarms they think that because the lights are flashing that the alarm is actually working and everything is all okay it's not strictly true the other thing some people say is that the left light means this and the right light means that or some people will say oh the red light means this and the blue light means that or the red light means this and the green light means that. Many moons ago some bell boxes did actually have one light. That was to indicate that all was well, the battery was being charged and that was it. But then someone came up with the idea of making them flashing. So they called them comfort lights. But as I said, some people still insist that the left light means tamper and the right light means that the battery is being charged. But as you can see, it's not actually true. There are some bell boxes still out there whereby the LEDs do actually mean something. But 99% of the time, if they're flashing like this, they are just purely comfort lights and they do nothing. Or to make someone that does not know think that there is a live bell box and they have a working alarm. More on that shortly. This particular bell box doesn't have a switch to turn the comfort lights off. So that's why I put tape over them. Because I don't really like them, I don't much care for them. It lulls people into a false sense of security, literally. I'll put the cover back on and um, we should continue with something else I have to show you. There we are. You can't see the lights. Well, that is, you can't see them in daylight because the tape is obscuring them. As I said, I personally don't like them. Here is another example. These ones are called twinkles. Part of the reason is they use even less battery power than normal ones do. But then again, it has to. Because believe it or not, this bell box actually has a solar panel inside it. It's actually in the blue part, the stripy part you can see there. It's a solar panel. So I've shown you a couple of bell boxes with comfort lights. What do you do if you have a dummy box? That can't have lights, can it? Well actually one of the ones you saw was actually a dummy box. It's got a solar panel in it as well. But also you can buy one of these. This is from eBay cost less than a fiver. PCB battery holder. Let's put some batteries in it. There we are. Comfort lights. Yep, that's what these are meant for. You're meant to put these in a dummy bell box so that people assume that you have a real alarm or people that have an alarm are given comfort by the fact their bell box is flashing. As you saw in the bell box I showed you earlier, from the green lights in it, you buy the bell box and it comes with lights in it already, but you can't turn them off. So you use something like this if you have a dummy bell box. 
put a minute and away you go. If you like what you've seen, a thumbs up would be great. A subscription to the channel, which is free, would be marvellous. And as always, thanks for watching.